While Christopher Roy's fellow firefighters work through their grief, residents pause over the pile of flowers in front of his Webster Square firehouse. He passed on doing what he loved doing. It's the kind of reflection exhausted Worcester firefighters will get a chance to take in tomorrow as a group of those who retired from the department return to the job to man all of the city's fire stations. The firefighters are here 24-7, 365 days a year. Retired Lieutenant John Griffin will be suited up and working here. You might have to dust the cobwebs off a little bit and say, where was that street again? They'll be joined by 80 firefighters from 25 towns filling in so Worcester firefighters can focus on grieving and honoring Roy. And they need to take a step back. Auburn Chief Stephen Coleman helped organize the massive mutual aid effort. When we suffer a loss, um, regardless of whether it was our community, we all suffer that loss. Does it bring grief back for you? Yes. Griffin was on the job when six of his fellow firefighters were killed in the cold storage and warehouse fire, and also when firefighter John Davies died in a building collapse seven years ago. Kind of opens up those old wounds, you know, that you're, you put in the back of your mind because you go back to work, you try and get it done, but you're always thinking of those guys. Those mutual aid firefighters who take over at times like this are called pilots. And they plan to take over at 7 a.m. tomorrow and work through to Sunday morning a full 25 hours. That's camaraderie. In Worcester, Christina Hager, WBZ News.